Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ms. Roxanne. This is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing Arrow. We're doing Season 3, Episode 16. It's called The Offer. And I'm so shaving in the next few days because we have company coming and I don't want to mess up the bathroom because my hair gets everywhere. Anyway, that's probably a little too much info. But today we're going to, like I said, we're going to go over the Arrow episode, The Offer. So let's jump right into it. So we have Raza Ghoul kind of showing all of her around, like it's no big deal. It's like this is just, you know, my last worst pit. It, re it revives people and stuff. And if all these people at your command, it's not just awesome. It's kind of like almost like a business deal, which is, I, thought was, I thought that was kind of interesting. And Oliver is like not really impressed. So I'm like, okay. So he also explains how uh, the workings of the League of Assassins and then, um, just lets them go. It's like, okay, bye. <laughs> and then Thea lets Nessa go. And then Roy tranks her. And then we have Roz shows him the Lazarus Pit. And he said, because Alfred made a um, brought a decent point that, like, hey, you're called Leave of Assassins. I don't want to do killings anymore, so how's that going to work? He said, uh, we can, we can renounce killing if you want to, because, um, you're the race, you can do whatever you want, basically. So, we have that. And then, they just leave, and then Oliver thinks it over, and just says no, and kind of leaves. But Oliver doesn't tell Team Arrow about the deal or anything, so it's kind of shady. And then Maceo, uh, then, uh, sorry, Kiro, runs off, but Oliver finds him. And they go to the gardens, because he wants to go to the gardens, because that's where they say they meet up all the time. And going back to the present, Oliver lets Nessa go, because um, Ray trained her before she could do anything. And then um, he said that you can go. Razagul says, everything's fine, bye. And she doesn't believe him, but she does go. Then we cut to Aristotle's uh, um, a deal going down. And then Lance is really mad at Arrow. Like, really mad at Arrow. Because he knew that Sarah was dead and he didn't tell her, tell him about it. And so that's the whole thing. And then you have Felicity babbling. And, um,. Interrupts uh, Ray and Felicity, and then she babbles some more. So that's a really funny moment. Then Thea and Laurel talk, and then um, a little, like a little heart to heart moment thing about Sarah, and you know how she still doesn't blame her and everything. Then Thea and Malcolm have a heated conversation where Malcolm says, "We need to go." She's like, "I ain't going by." Then we have Nissa is furious with her dad, which is Raza Ghoul. And she says, shut it, child. <laughs> She's like, okay. <laughs> but um, then, follow, then, <laughs> then finally, Oliver um, finally tells Diggle about the Raza Ghoul deal. And Oliver is actually considering it because he makes a good point because he says he, he's been doing Spiro about three years. And in that time, he feels like, the city hasn't gotten better, and if I had a team of people helping, and then maybe we could actually get some stuff done, and they can renounce killing if the next watch our goal. So it kind of does make sense about that. And Oliver's, then Diggle's like, no, sorry. <laughs> and then we have a flashback scene where um, Oliver and Akio uh, run. And um, they're running away from the uh, masked people in the, in the gardens because they have, um, they have um, basically bodyguards there and they're on the lookout for Oliver Queen and, uh, and Masaya's family. So when they saw him, they go after him and start shooting him at him and stuff. And so they run for it. Then we go back to the present day where Oliver is lost. Not physically lost, but kind of mentally lost because he kind of doesn't know what to do. And then you have a little Alicity moment, which is just a tiny one, but I love Alicity. 
I do ship that the most. I ship a lot of different ships. <laughs> but I do like Elicity the most. And then, um, then we cut to a uh, family Lance talk. And Lance cannot forgive Laurel at all. He basically says, like, I love you, but I can't forgive you for what you did. I don't know if I'll be, ever be able to get over that. And we need just to distance ourselves from each other for a little bit. And then uh, this guy named Murmur attacks SCPD. Uh, Team Era helps out. And basically, um, Oliver decides he's not going to go through with Ross and he's not going to do it. They have the flashback scene where uh, he runs into Shadow, which we know she's dead. So I don't know how she ran into Shadow, but they did. And then you have the present day where Nitsa wants to talk to Laurel. And then, um, and then um, we have Oliver telling Sayo that he refuses and. Um, Maceo says, you better watch yourself because, um, he gets what he wants, basically. And then we have, um, Thea visits Roy. They make out. And then we have Ross and actually impersonates Sarah during a drug deal. And, um, uh, literally kills a person. And, well, two or three people, he lets, let the last person, uh, live and tell him, Tell him the arrow did this tonight to everyone you see. And so basically he's trying to meet he's trying to turn the city against him and stuff. So um that's the end of the episode. I really did like this episode. I'll give us a plus. I like the um I just like the episode a lot. It's really good. So um I think this is gonna do it for me. And if you like this video, y'all know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe. I should say subscribe at the beginning, but I don't want to be that D-bag and just automatically get rid of viewers. Anyway, I'm going to do it once or twice. See what happens. So anyway, um, like I said, if you like this, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll promise I'll stop saying that twice. I don't know why I do that. But anyway, I want y'all to have a super awesome day, and I'll see you on my next video. Bye, everybody.